When you come across VHS tapes and there's like commercials on it, like people have taped a movie off of television and, and it's packed with commercials, some people actually consider commercials to be an important thing. The Lloyd's a wicked wizard who makes pizzas old and cold. And now he's off to meet his greatest challenge, the magic of hot fresh Domino's pizza. So this is the Noid. Uh, this is the credit line playset. There was a whole range of Noid products made um, in the 80s. This was meant to promote Domino's Pizza. After they came out with the Noid, um, there was a, uh, a guy, a real life guy that popped up. Um, his name was Kenneth Lamar Noid, um, shares a last name with the name of this um, character. Problem is, uh, Kenneth Lamar Noid was mentally unstable, and whenever he saw the commercials for this, which said, avoid the Noid, he thought they were talking about him. So what Noid decides to do is he holds a Domino's pizza hostage, like he actually goes in there, um, holds everybody in the, in the business uh, hostage, um, police come, of course, and he makes a series of demands. He demands things like $100,000. He does also demand that they make him a special pizza uh, and a salad, and they end up doing this. Uh, after he gets that, he winds up surrendering to police um, in the stand-up. Luckily, nobody is um, seriously hurt. Um, the police arrest him, they send him to a mental institution where he then commits suicide. Um, with all of that, the Noid stops becoming a cute promotional character and becomes a reminder of a really horrible um, incident. Domino's realizes they can no longer, um, uh, with any responsibility, continue to release Noid products. You know, if you look at all those 80s commercials like He-Man, and uh, you know, a clearly obsessed, a steroid obsessed uh, culture, or like the Toxic Avenger toys, or Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle toys. All of that was sort of like this uh, nuclear era, Cold War uh, sort of fear thing about nuclear waste and annihilation and all that stuff. It's not just weird things like exercise tapes. It can also be like, um, you know, things like commercials and advertisement, which which may be lost. I mean, some of those companies have gone out of business, you know.